Hello, Brockton community. My name is Angel Cosme. I am the mutual aid community organizer with Brockton Interfaith Community. I just want to talk a little bit about some events that are coming up and a little bit about who Brockton Interfaith Community is. So I'm going to start by reading a very quick credential. Uh, Brockton Interfaith Community was founded in 1990. It's a multi-faith, multi-ethnic nonprofit organization from the greater Brockton area. Our mission is to work collaboratively on issues chosen together in order to promote racial and economic justice through prophetic, faith-rooted community organizing. We advocate at the state level as NCAM and at the national level as Faith in Action. By building power locally through intentional relationships, we aspire to create systems and structures for the purposes of establishing a more equitable and just world. Uh, one of the things that we recently uh, carried out was a Dismantling Racism in Brockton Public Schools event that was attended by our superintendent, uh, Michael Thomas. This event took place on March 24th. And uh, we asked several questions of the school district. For example, will the school district publicly commit to making uh, deeper bias trainings mandatory uh, for BPS staff? Uh, other questions that we asked was, uh, Will the district commit to providing racial and ethnic data specifically uh, pertaining to BPS administration and teachers? Uh, and will this data be available on the uh, BPS website? And uh, of course, trying to increase staff of color with various percentage benchmarks. And um, a couple of other questions were asked as well. Uh, we're very grateful that the superintendent and the, and the school district uh, committed to these asks. And uh, we are also in the process of collecting stories of, um, you know, racism or hardships within the schools. And if you have any stories to share along those lines, you can email uh, one of the organizers working on this. His name is Game. And the email is R as in Richard, C as in Cat, A as in Angel, M as in Michael, at MyRestoration.org. So it's RCAM at MyRestoration.org. Uh, also, in the beginning of this year, the, the big staff met and we decided to uh, prioritize certain areas of focus. And those four areas of focus have to do with racial justice through systemic change work. So things like supporting immigrants, challenging racism in all forms, uh, economic justice versus, uh, excuse me, via cooperatives, um, development, uh, education, of the community, so we have uh, School of Prophetic Action trainings that are occurring, voter mobilization, um, immigrant forums coming up, and number four, community building. So we would be offering classes, we have mutual aid supports, uh, direct services through the mutual aid network. Um, and basically we intend to uh, approach these initiatives by building and democratizing a communal economy uh, uh, democratizing and reforming the public arena, dismantling white supremacy, and democratizing and reimagining health and wellness. So those are some of the areas of focus. And of course, we intend to train and liberate uh, some leaders in the Brockton community. Lastly, there is an event happening uh, tonight um, uh, that has to do, it's called Justice for Jamie. Jamie Resende is an individual who's currently incarcerated, although he was uh, exonerated and acquitted of his charges. That's happening uh, from 5 to 6.30 tonight. And then on Wednesday, this Wednesday, there is a uh, event with the Plymouth County DA's office. Um, and it's uh, holding the DA accountable, um, learning about the effects of the DA on the community, and determining priorities around uh, issues involving the Brockton community. Uh, it's also a partnership with ACLU. There are tons of things going on with the, with the uh, Brockton Interfaith uh, community and mutual aid. If you want more information, you can go to brocktoninterfaith.org or you can email mutualaid at brocktoninterfaith.org. My name is Angel Cosme. Thank you so much. And we hope to uh, invite you into the work. Thank you, Brockton. Mm -hmm.